Today, I'm making Devonshire squab pie. It is a simple and delicious dish using mutton and apples. For this recipe, you will need apples, onion, mutton, butter, puff pastry, fat, some stock, and for seasoning, salt, and pepper. The flavour of onion isn't much liked by the family, as it's generally felt it encourages bad breath and bloating. However, a little bit of well-cooked onion works really well in this pie, so I'm using half an onion. Sylvia has already peeled and cooled the apples, so now I'm going to slice them evenly. Squab means pigeon. There isn't any pigeon in this pie. And I don't know why it's called Devonshire either. Although, coming from Devonshire, I can tell you there are plenty of apples. There are also quite a lot of sheep. I'm now going to brown off the meat. Mutton is one of my favourite meats. Some people think it's far superior to lamb. Mutton is leaner and more flavoursome and it takes on spice and strong flavours really well. It is ideal for slow cooking, depending on your cut. I've read that the Queen loves mutton and she favours sheep that are over 10 years. Now I've lined my dish with butter. I need to layer in the ingredients. Mutton first. And now half the onions. The apples. I'm going to highly season this dish with salt and pepper. And now to start again with the layering.
I'll now add my stock. Now this needs to go into an oven for an hour and a half. I need to cover it. I might save on my paper and use this salt paste. Obviously, I'm not going to serve it with this salt crust, so I shall just remove it. As this dish is for the family, I shall layer on now some puff pastry to elevate it to the right kind of dish. But first, I shall place in my pie funnel as when it's cooking, this will help the steam escape and mean the mixture can boil nicely. I'm going to cover it with this egg wash of egg, salt and a little milk. And now I'm going to decorate it to truly make it suitable for the family's table. I'm going to brush some of the egg wash on only some of the pastry to give it an effect. And now it needs to go back into the oven for 20 minutes. This is a fairly plain dish, suitable for the family at supper or luncheon. I wouldn't serve it to their guests, unless they were very well known by the family. There you are, Devonshire squab pie.